Hello everyone, welcome to Circuit Schools. In this video, I'm going to show how to upload hex files to Arduino boards like Uno and Nano. To do this first, we need to have a software named Xloader. You can get it from the GitHub easily. After downloading extract files into a folder and open the Xloader executable file, you can see the interface like this. On the first row, we have Choose File section, in which we can select the hex file which we want to upload to Arduino. On the second row, we have Device Selection drop-down, in which we can select the device we are using like Arduino Nano or other. Now let's connect an Arduino Nano to PC. Select the hex file which we want to upload. Now in the third row, there are two options. First one is a port. To find out on which port our Arduino is running, open Device Manager from Settings and check in the port section. To know exactly which is our port without any confusion, remove and connect Arduino again to PC. The one which disappear and comes back is the Our Arduino port. Now select the correct port on Xloader. The second option is the baud rate. By default, it will be 115,200. Keep it as it is and hit upload. As soon as you hit upload, the blinking LEDs on the Arduino indicates it's uploading. And finally, it's done. Let's connect Arduino Uno and upload it. In the same process, check the port from Device Manager and correct it in Xloader. Keep baud rate same and hit upload. That's it, LEDs blink and it's uploaded. Now let's solve some common issues while uploading. Can't open port, even when selecting correct port. If this error is showing, it means the port is used by any other software. In my case, it's open in Arduino IDE. Let's close and try to upload it again. Yes, it's working now. Now coming to next problem, if the uploading info shows for ages, or it's stuck, it means the baud rate which we used is not working. There are various baud rates available for Arduino. Try these. The official manufactured ones works well with default baud rate, but with clones, these issues occurs. Close the X loader using Task Manager and check with other baud rates until success. That's it, you are ready to go. If this video helped you, please like this video and subscribe to our channel Circuit Schools for more informative videos. See you in the next video.